what is up guys welcome to the big unbox where we do that small tech and today i am back with another big unboxing for you for the pixel buds 2 and today we're back with a case from nomad this is going to be the rugged leather case to unbox do a quick review as always i'll throw up the link in the video description if you want to check it out pricing is going to be 35 bucks so it's going to be steep but you got to keep in mind it is a leather product so you got to keep that in mind when you're actually doing the purchase it's going to be expensive but it should feel premium come in two different colors you got black and then you got a tan color i want the black because that should look really really nice with the the black and white pixel buds themselves anyway so we'll go and check it out to see if it's going to be a hit or miss guys for your pixel buds to presentation it is what it is you got a nice little branding up top rugged case and then it tells you a little more details about the leather itself right there pixel buds at the very bottom and then the back's going to tell you a little more details day one versus day 100 so it's really telling you that the wear and tear should be minimal and look really nearly nice after day 100 of use so presentation looks good let's go and bust it open to see if it's a hit or miss for your pixel buds let's check it out here what we're going to get got a nice little lanyard i probably won't use that but it is what it, it's a nice little added touch. We'll put that to the side. Looks like you got some stickers, pixel buds, removal instructions, all that good stuff. Put that to the side. All right, here's the leather material that you're going to get the case. So nice feel to it. Now, the first thing I did notice, this has got a real deep scratch. Look at that thing. That's This came with a deep scratch out of the gate. So you can just tell, look at that. So when you're spending that type of cash flow, look at that deep scratch. You wouldn't expect this one to be uh, dinged up like that. So we'll probably contact them. It's obviously not going to affect the review because you would expect it to be wear and tear a little bit, but not out of the gate. This thing's all scratched up. So I wouldn't expect that out of the you know initial unboxing. But the leather material does feel super soft, nice premium feel to it interior's got the same type of leather material around the edges so you can really barely see it just because of the black on black but it definitely has got a nice little feel to it does got a little bit of led light cut out right there very small which i appreciate that so we'll be able to tell and test it out with the wireless charging got the button right there the bumper itself has got this plastic material around the actual edges so you can see that's actually I mean, the bumper is this little plastic material and then the power Let's check out the top, check out the helmet. Got a little bit of Nomad branding right there. Subtle, same type of plastic material where it transitions back into the leather and then the soft leather material around the actual interior of the case itself. So very nice build quality there. So let's go and check this out. Should look really clean with that white and black pixel buds too. So let's go and make sure I put this on right. There we go, nice tight fit. Got its helmet, put this on, snaps right into place. Dang, that looks pretty nice with that black on white. And that kind of that black on black too, the panda buds. Look at that, real clean. Nice shell. Again, you can tell that leather looks really classy, soft to the touch. Definitely going to add some bulk to it, but it's probably going to give you more grip as well. It's very grippy. Pop it open like this, and that looks really clean with the black on black and then the white transitions to the actual black right there so that looks really really clean look at that that looks really really nice definitely build quality is excellent just the actual premiumness of this case and then i like the way it complements the black on white just looks really really nice together very nice guys you can see the only you got the cutout right there around the hinge so that's it is what it is you're just going to have that area right there that's exposed but there's really nothing to do about it looks like it's a little bit you can see just a little bit of cut around this top part, but for the most part, they did a pretty good job with the actual cut. As it's, and then the button right there, it's a little stiff, could be a little clickier. You got your cutout right there around the port, and again, you got the LED light right there, so it is popping through. Let's check out the wireless charging. Should work. Let's check it right there. Boom, wireless charging works, so it is 100% compatible with this. Overall, I gotta say the build quality is excellent. It's definitely gonna be expensive, but it's gonna be a little addition to you're you're already paying 170 bucks for an expensive pair of Pixel Buds too. This is a nice little addition that's gonna give it a little premium, extra premium feel to it. And then honestly, you're gonna feel more comfortable 
taking these around. So I appreciate the actual fact that you're going to get a little extra protection for this actual pair of pixel buds. So overall, it's expensive. I think I got a damaged one with that scratch. I'll probably have to get, you know, get with them to see if they'll give me a replacement. Cause 35 bucks is expensive, but overall, I'm going to say it's a hit. Let me know what you guys think about this one. Hit or miss. We going hit. Hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys next time.